Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Alex from Computer Headquarters and uh, today I am back at the office. Uh, last Friday I mentioned on my YouTube channel that we had a scammer buy an RTX 4090 from us and claim and in return an RTX 3080 with no serial numbers on it and claim that we scammed him. Um, I wanted to follow up with that because he has since posted an unboxing video where he shows quote-unquote proof that we scammed him. Uh, let's watch his video together, okay? And sorry, his, his microphone seems to be pretty bad. He talks the whole time. Also, he cusses a lot. So uh, I don't usually do cussing on my YouTube channel, but today there'll be some F words. It won't be me talking, saying them. It'll be him. So warning for anyone that's sensitive to cuss words. Uh, anyway, here we go. Here's his unboxing video. Here's his YouTube channel right here. Uh, Ethelheim for subscribers. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, because they missed shipping yesterday. Even though I was home and was waiting at the door. I'm going to do this problem. I'm going to do this problem. Probably not. This is only a four minute video, guys, so this won't take too long. Okay. I will try mentioning things. So, I thought it was a little bit weird that the box long ways is left to right right now but he oh, has to, it's in the box the other way which is i don't think we would have packed it that way um first of all i also think that all the things he's saying right now he's just totally doing an acting job he's trying to act innocent by the way who records opening every box they get from the mail does it's dirty what the fuck is that, man? But and there's like no. Uh, there's no seal. Seal. I'll show you guys. Um, we have these in the okay, stock so right now, so I'll go show you one from the <laughs> shelf that we have. What they look like when they're brand new. Check number. Yeah. Also dirty without a seal. What? All right, coming up is the next thing that I thought was a little bit unusual. I, I can't say how unusual this is, but it, to me, when he opens this next box. Right. Still no seal. What the Right here. Oh, he hasn't opened it yet. What is he doing? Should be there something? There shouldn't be one there, no. There's not supposed to be a seal there. Open the box, buddy. buddy. <laughs> Let's go. So the, the pamphlet, if he ever opens this box, my lord. Okay, the pamphlet's oh. sideways, and Gigabyte is pretty meticulous about doing everything exactly the same way every time, and I don't think it would have been like that. Um, although I guess it doesn't matter at this point, because he's, he's claiming that whatever was in the box wasn't correct so i guess this this part doesn't matter i also don't think that if he was really doing some sort of like unboxing for his social media or something i don't think he'd be like spending this much time looking at the manual and the warranty card he's trying to really act innocent right now and act like he doesn't know it's already gonna happen when he gets to the 3080 in there Okay, dude. That does not look right. That does not look right. Yeah, I wonder why. I wonder why. Oh, hell no. That's too small for... Do you... you see this? Oh, 
What is this man? <sighs> acting. He's acting. So I'm going to cut the camera uh, from OBS here on my computer, and we're going to go look at the box that he returned. Okay, so I'm literally right next to I was just taking that last clip. This is a tape gun that I grabbed from our warehouse. These are the tape guns we use. Here's the box. I'm not going to show you the top of the box right now because it has his address. I'm not trying to show his address, but this is the top of the box that he showed in the video, okay? This is the scotch tape he used to seal the box. This is, this is his game. He thinks he's so smart. I'm going to use a different type of tape here. He opened the package on the bottom. Sorry. This is where he actually opened the box so that when he would do his unboxing video that it would look like he opened it for the first time. Of course he didn't show the bottom of the box in his unboxing video because he's a scammer. Um, yeah, also, I just want to mention something. I didn't, I didn't check this earlier. This box is square. It's 20 by 20. So he did have the video card in one way and I thought it looked like it should go the other, but it doesn't matter. It's the same way. But let's, let's show you what's actually important here. This is our tape on the bottom, but look, you see how much tape there is? See all of this tape? There's a reason why there's so much tape. It's because he opened it and then he resealed it for shipping it back to us. And this is the way you can really tell. See this tape strip right here? I started peeling this off to check it. And let me lift it up for you right here. You see the thickness of this, like the width from here to here? Watch. Here's our tape gun. You see how much wider, I guess I should go like right, right there. You see how much wider our tape is? This, this isn't, this isn't our tape. This is like, if you go to Staples or someplace and you buy packaging tape that's clear, this is like the standard size that you would buy from like a commercial type place, like a state, uh, consumer type place, I meant to say, like a Staples or someplace like that. If you're doing industrial stuff, when you're ordering stuff from like Uline, like big distributor that all they deal in is like packaging and boxes. You don't, you don't use thin tape like that because it wastes time and materials. You use a big tape gun like this with big tape so that you can use less. Um, it takes less time to use a wider piece of tape. So this isn't our tape. He taped it back up. He's a scammer. Um, I already showed you the other video with the card where it doesn't even have a serial number on it. Um, and then, in fact, in the same motion, I wasn't really planning on doing this, but just for more proof... I'm going to walk out to the warehouse. We have some 4090s right here. None of these have a seal on them. This is how they come from Gigabyte. All of them are like that. So some companies do seal their products. Like, let's see, here's a 3900 XTX. These are brand new also. Is there anything on this? Yeah. XFX seals that with a sticker on both sides. <clears throat> but not every brand does it that way. Here's an MSI card. They do a shrink wrap thing on the outside. Everyone, everyone does it different. Everyone can do their own, do it like the way they want to do it, right? So I'm just going to grab one of these. This wasn't set up for this video or anything. Just trying to keep people's faces in the office off the camera in case they don't want to be on it. So, I'm gonna, sorry, I need both hands here. I'm just showing you the other side also, no, no tape, no sticker. Here's the inside of the box, no tape, no sticker. As I mentioned earlier, this is facing straight up. Here's a card. There's a bracket. There's a bunch of other stuff that come with it. Looks like this came loose probably in shipping, but you know, there's like some Oris badge. There's the adapter card, the, that stuff. Here's the card itself, it's sealed. It has the same sticker stuff that that guy showed in the video on his thing. He open this. He took this stuff out because he needed it for the card. 
He put some old card. He removed the this, uh, serial number off of his card just in case it got traced back to him somehow. Then he took this anti-stag bag and put his old card back in. And then made this stupid video where he acts like he just opened it even though he's lying. And I said this in the last video. Scamming little businesses like mine. This isn't like Amazon.com that he's trying to rip off. He's actually ripping off a little business like Computer Headquarters. Uh, we're not going to stand for it. He needs to understand that this is a federal crime. He's going to get in big trouble. He should return the card as soon as possible so that we don't press charges against him. If you're watching the video, do the right thing. Say you're sorry. Return the 4090 and we'll let bygones be bygones.